Welcome to the Lotus Goddess Divine Love. Hi everyone, how's everyone doing today? Hope you're doing well and staying safe. Welcome back everyone. Welcome if you're new to my channel. I do Divine Mask and Divine Feminine Twin Flame Journey Charm Readings. Let's begin and just keep in mind that this is a general reading. I want to show you something that just happened when I dropped the charms. This one just shot over right to the corner. It's wedding bands. So this is a reunion reading. That's the first, first one that stands out here. Let's see what's happening. And, and so that's what the tray looks like. <laughs> I know my camera. Just a little bit, but there we go. And for those who are wondering what, what ring I'm wearing, I'm wearing angel ring. So let's see their wings. And I'm wearing this ring. This, this stone is known as angel skin. I don't know if you can see. It's like a two-tone pinkish color kind of looks like ice but there's a pink tone to it for those who are curious <laughs> okay let's get started with the reading So I see here, there is this opportunity for a reunion. Uh, somebody, somebody who is very close to reunion. So this is a divine masculine who has done their work, who has grown, evolved, who has transformed themselves internally, and the external is reflecting what they feel inside. So I see here, self love. Um, their environment is very joyful um there's love happiness a new beginning for this divine masculine and they have put a close to a chapter that should have been closed a long time ago this is someone who has not only sealed that book but that book is nowhere to be found it's like it's it's done it's it's gone i see here this transformation will lead to a reunion there is wish fulfillment here they are sad without their Divine Feminine, so they don't want to be away from Divine Feminine any longer. This is a Divine Masculine who's ready, ready to commit to Divine Feminine. They were stuck in some sort of pattern where they used to believe in a certain way. So that's one of the things that kept them from moving towards divine feminine it it looks like some kind of like a loop so this could be like internal dialogue some kind of negative dialogue or a negative thought that was ongoing this was something that this divine masculine could not um could not push aside so that they could move forward but it looks like that they got over over whatever that was that hurdle so i see here that there was something that kept them stuck for a long period of time and it looks like it was repeating. Uh, I don't see it as a repeating cycle. I see it as a repeating kind of habit or a way of thinking or a way of doing things. So they need to change that, that about themselves. And I see here that they became more aware. So it shows here on knowledgeable wisdom, consciously aware of whatever things that was keeping them held stagnant um, and from preventing them from moving towards divine feminine they feel very lucky they feel very blessed to have met you they feel very blessed and honored to fall in love with you this is a divine masculine who is planning to move forward and i feel it's quite strong in this reading that's the main focus in this reading is reunion i see a lot of love wanting to start a new beginning uh, feeling quite lost 
without you. So this is a masculine who doesn't want to live life anymore without their counterpart. So I see that this divine masculine, they're really stuck in their feelings. So they're really thinking about you. They're really feeling the love for you. And they feel like there's no other way. There's nothing else but you. They want to restore this connection. I see very strongly here that they want to restore the connection, have a reunion with Divine Feminine. They find it difficult to approach that first step to start communication and initiate contact. Um, but some some cases it has to do because of the distance, like you two might be at a distance. I do see some sort of travel here. So for those who are at a, at a distance, this is one of the things that this masculine is thinking about. Um, it could be like visiting Divine Feminine or thinking about actually moving in Divine Feminine's area. So there's something about being closer to you. They feel like the distance has created distance. So it's not only like emotional distance that was created, but the physical distance contributed to that. So they feel like the distance, if we were only closer, if we were only able to see each other, maybe things would be easier for us or maybe things would have been different. So this masculine seeing the distance as as an obstacle or they see it as as something that's coming in the way between you and them and the reunion. So this is a divine masculine who wants to travel. I see her travel moving. Um, they don't want just communication by text, by phone, by, you know, call. They don't want that. They don't want it through technology. They want face-to-face -face interaction. They want to see you in person. They want to talk to you, hear your voice. They want to be close to, close proximity to you. It has to do with the energy, the longing to connect with Divine Feminine energetically. They're trying to maintain it's like they're trying to be cool about this i see here trying to meet be calm maintain their it, there's something about feeling impatient there's a little bit about feeling impatient the more time they spend away from you it's making them um uncomfortable so this is a divine masculine who feels driven to move towards divine feminine if it looks like they are really being guided and pushed towards divine feminine. This is something that has to do with divine timing and the timing is right for this divine masculine, whoever this resonates for. They are finding the strength within themselves to make the changes needed in order to be with divine feminine. I see her, they're, they're coming in prepared. They're coming in strong, strong as a king. There will be conversations here. Divine masculine may share this with people who they are close to. So they might share this with family members. Family members may be aware that Divine Masculine is planning to make a move. So <laughs> when I say planning to make a move, I mean physically move, okay? Not not like to, <laughs> you know what I mean. <laughs> so planning to make a move towards Divine Feminine. So moving from one city to another, one country to another, okay? So I see here that there is wish fulfillment, wish fulfillment uh, for this divine masculine. Masculine in this reading, he's very confident. He feels that he will, he will have victory with divine feminine. There will be justice, meaning that this, this love will, will not be, will not be lost. There will be reunion here and divine masculine will work really hard to make it happen. It's like, this is someone who will not take no for an answer. And I don't feel like it's it has something because I'm getting this very strongly. Some may question like, does this mean that they're going to pressure Divine Feminine into a relationship? No, that's not what this is. This is a Divine Feminine who is ready, who is ready for reunion. This is a Divine Masculine who is ready for reunion. And they will not take a no from an, as an answer, meaning not from divine feminine, but it's like, I will not stand in my own way of getting into reunion with my divine feminine, no matter what, whether it be fear, doubt, worry, uh, lack of confidence. It's like, no, 
I had enough. I will not accept that anymore. I will do what I need to do in order to reconnect with my my counterpart with with divine feminine. So this is a divine masculine who will move. I feel like very quickly and will take take wise steps. This will be well well thought out based off of what they feel so their guidance their internal guidance their their internal compass and i see here that they will they will go with the current and not against the current so this is the reading for today i hope you like this reading if you like this reading please subscribe to my channel leave a comment below and thank you for watching have a beautiful day bye everyone